What are we even doing here? Yeah, yeah. Here's one. Old Fisherman brand roasted eel with fermented black beans. Uh-huh, uh-huh. So this is my first, like, hey, it's from China, or technically from Taiwan. So, um, geez, that's a sticky wicket, but it's conger eel, which is, um, you know, it's an eel. There's a photograph, um, there's a fork, so it's like very inclusive. Uh, ingredients, yeah, yeah. Can you read some of these? There's a lot of them. Conger eel, water, fermented beans, sugar, soy sauce, capsicum, hmm? Vinegar, barbecue powder, salt, anise, cinnamon, fennel, pepper. Oh yeah, all kinds of stuff. Rice, yeast, MSG, whatever. Anyway, let's check it out. Helpful what they've done here is they've provided illustrated instructions for opening the can. I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna read them. I'm just gonna assume that I know how to open this can. It's like every other can. And um, if it's not and I get into trouble, then, you know, there will be a certain entertainment value with that. All right. First of all, oh yeah, smells good on the inside. Cow. Wa bunga. That's some pretty nice lid. Yeah, yeah, it came right off. And then what are we looking at? We've got these fermented black beans. Delicious. Kind of sweet. Okay. And I'm just going to take a bite. Uh-huh, 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 uh-huh. What was that? This sort of sinewy stuff that's coming off the sides? Yeah. Pretty tasty. The meat itself did not really have that much body to it. It kind of, it's a little bit crumbly. It's a little bit like, it's not flaky. It's not very much like um, unagi, though here is kind of a fatty piece with some skin on it, so. Hmm. I'll tell you what we're gonna do. We're gonna go rice. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Presto. Yeah, so I've got myself a little bowl of rice here and I'm gonna, I'm gonna put this eel on top of this rice because I think this is the way that God intended me to eat this stuff. And uh, I just feel like sort of doing it right for once. Because everybody else that tries some of this stuff on the uh, YouTube, like they're gonna, they're gonna put it on rice, right? You gotta assume, huh? And this is, uh, this is definitely, this is the white rice that I have laying around the house. Uh, it's like some kind of Japanese brand. Uh, it's grown in California, you know, so. Pretty decent stuff. I can't vouch for how fresh it is. I'm just gonna try to get some of these beans on top of here too. And uh, yeah, gosh, some spine action here? Perhaps, I'm not sure what all this is. There's very kind of, lots of uh, lattice-y type uh, structures bound up here. Okay, now I'll put the rest of this eel to the side and then we'll have a nice picture of it. Yeah, and now I'm ready to have a good old time, you know? Oh man, and so some of this stuff is gonna get on the rice, right? Now we're gonna find out how bad I am with chopsticks for real. Mm. Yeah, this is pretty good. I think the texture, the texture leaves something to be desired if you are, um, if you're really just an Unagi Don boy, you know? Uh, but you know what? This sauce is really neat. It's, it's really different, you know? Yeah. 
Mm-hmm. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, anyway, so just picking up sardines with chopsticks is easy. Because they're just like little, little tweezers. But eating like rice with it, it's a different thing. Especially when there's stuff mixed up in the rice, the rice becomes a little looser. This is going to seem a little bit easier at first because the rice is right out of the old rice cooker and um, still clumping together pretty good. This is a dang meal. I'm getting into this. Now that I've taken the pretty picture, we're just going to go nuts. Yeah, 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 yeah. Mm-hmm. everybody's doing okay. I'm gonna eat for a second while we thank my Patreon supporters. I'm trying to upload exclusive content to there. Should a little faster and looser. I don't do as many edits. I don't score them. But if you really like watching my videos, you know, there's like probably ooh, six or so original videos up there, exclusive videos, in the tank for you, yeah. So this is fun. Look, the texture is just its own thing. And now this rice is just, uh, you see what I'm talking about? And at the end, I'll go full on bad table manners and I'll just shove all this stuff in my mouth. Meanwhile, we're gonna take it up another notch. Yeah, yeah. You know who I'm talking about. This is uh, this is some chili crisp, huh? Yeah. You know, you see it all over the internet, and uh, kind of got turned onto this stuff because it was in that can of uh, fishwife sam. I don't want to add too much. I'm at the bottom of this jar here. I gotta get some more. I think I'm gonna do a video just about adding this stuff to sardines. I'm gonna see how that works. See what the best way to do it is. Uh, let's see, let's see if this works with that, huh? Oh yeah, party time. Kind of, um, kind of the missing note here, definitely. Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah. Now I'm just enjoying this in front of you. Kind of out of things to say. That's okay. Mm. Okay, I'm gonna end the video here. But after the camera stops rolling, I'm gonna finish Every grain of rice that's in this bowl, I'm going to finish it all off, I swear to God. Okay, thanks for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.